10, a couple of hours. So I'm happy with that. And pack up and go home. Okay. Hi, so good. Beautiful morning. Snow everywhere. Uh, today I'm out for some pigeon. As farmers request, you see, it has a bit of rape in the back for the sheep, and the pigeons are um, attacking pretty, pretty hard, and because of the snow. So I set up some decoys, but today they're working. I think at the moment the pigeons are more interested to be roosting uh, in the sunshine. So. It has a patch of trees down the bottom, so I'm walking towards the trees because a lot of pigeons are coming and go from the trees, so let's see if I can bag a few. Catch the bit. So, been doing some shooting. I have to take <laughs> I have to take the, the leaf camo off because that that piece of woodland is so rough. To, to go to collect the pigeons, I was getting stuck everywhere, so before I tear my present apart, I have to take them out. Uh, I shot a few already, about five or six. Uh, but yeah, the, I'm shooting with a, with a, a new gun. Uh, I just got a new gun, not new, but you know, new on my gun cabinet. Uh, and I'm gonna talk a little bit about it. It's um, E. Razzini. Uh, she's in very nice, nice conditions. Multi choke with extractors. Um, I really like that gun. That gun was, belong was belonging to my, my friend, Mac for Mike, and uh, I really like that gun. Since the first day he bought it and I feel it, I like that gun. And because I'm a, a quite tall, tall, guy you know and big hands i like that grip you see the swallow on the grip that's something my lumber doesn't have and that feels chunky so i really like it so yeah very nice condition i may do another video about it later but um just to give you a quick look at it so you know i still have to to get used to it a little bit so but yeah I like it I like it very wide red just a second get a review and doing a review get a few pigeons <laughs> you see one down Second shot, no? It fell right behind me. Reload. So, I was saying, I just felt the... the There he goes. <laughs> that thing.
that thing shooting with the camera between the fingers to hold the, the forehand is not easy, but <laughs> the things I do to share my hands with you guys, so you know. Probably, probably I'm gonna have to grab another camera to be able to show it how I do it. I don't have any mount, I don't use any tape, so you know, probably I can do it because I have big hands, uh, long fingers. Would be maybe difficult for others to do it. So I shot it. I just shot a pigeon. He hit against the tree and he managed to balance himself on the tree. There you go. Balance for the second time on the tree. Some of them just refuse to die. Oh well. It's life to me and you. Come another one. Let's see. Why the camera is on. I'm trying to record it. Second one is coming. I got it. I'm gonna die for that one gonna gonna die far. Double. I can see the pigeons coming, they're coming, about five or six of them, and I'm gonna let them go over the trees. And pigeon down. And I just hope you see that. Simple. When you are grabbing the camera, forget it about it. Don't. If you get the shot on camera, good. If you don't, good. You get the pigeon at least. So let's go and collect the pigeon. Another one there. And I have to say, it will be me for now, because I'm running out of SIM card or memory, so I should have bring another card, but I never realized, you know, it just come another pigeon, so let's see if I can finish that with a bang. Here it comes, here it comes, as we go over the trees. Here it comes, you land, I'm gonna land, I'm gonna land. Well, see you, see you later guys, thank you for watching.